flag now, if you could see out in the patrol boats. And that signifies that the clock has just started. And it'll wind down to zero. The objective is to come from the north end of the pond and hit that starting line full tilt without crossing over before the clock hits zero. Okay, the boats are making, they're rounding that upper corner. Here they come. The boat on the inside looks pretty good. The blue boat may be a little bit early. That's Tim Norrie from Bow, New Hampshire in the blue boat. Colleen Tweedy on the inside in the 24B. She just finished second in the heat before. Jack Cavanaugh in third and Dad Sean in fourth. Typically this class is for the Oh, probably the 150 pounders. Um, Sean stepped up to make this work and the uh, additional weight probably is having an effect on his speed. Up the back stretch, it looks like Sean Cavanaugh, uh, Jack Cavanaugh moving up into second place, passing Tim Nori on the inside. This corner is very bumpy. As you can see, these boats bouncing. Um, last year, we had three incidents all in that corner. For some reason, uh, the wind just comes off of that cove and wreaks havoc with the water. The rest of the course is nice. Colleen Tweedy, Mansfield, Massachusetts. Defending South Shore Outboard National Champion. Jack Cavanaugh, 14-year-old student from Shapley, Maine. And Tim Nori from Bow, New Hampshire. Tim works for the Department of Environmental Services right here in New Hampshire. And it looks like Sean's called it quits. You need four boats to make a legal start to accumulate national high points. So that's why Sean went out there to help these fellas and girls out today. Colleen coming around the fourth corner. We'll be looking for the white flag, which signifies the last lap. Just in, like in car racing, the white flag's out. That boat's probably doing in the mid-50s. That's a 15 horsepower OMC engine. Not quite what OMC intended it for back when they made it for an aluminum fishing boat. Feel free as you're watching the races to interact and ask the drivers questions. We do ask you to stay on the um, rec field side of the snow fence due to insurance regulations. Uh, only drivers and crews that have signed a waiver with a wristband are permitted down by the water. But once the drivers come up out of the water, feel free to walk around, ask questions. They'll be more than accommodating. The checkered flag for Colleen Tweedy. We would give you her age, but I don't think that's a thing you do for women. So we'll, we'll let you, when you come up for an autograph, you can ask her what year she was born. Okay, next up will be the second and final heat of the 25 Superstock Runabout class. Hopefully we'll get all four boats off the beach this time. Tom Norrie had issues the first heat, but we'll see if we can get them going. You got Mike Ackerstrom in the 31A, Tim Norrie in the 33A, 